pretty cold these past few days. Me too, Madeline. And I've heard that we are expecting warmer temperatures in our near future. Jenna Warner joins us now with a little more detail on that. Jenna? Yes, guys, so it's warmer right now than it was yesterday. So the, we in Norman were 24 degrees warmer than we were yesterday 24 hours ago. And they're 26 degrees warmer in Tulsa than they were at this time yesterday. So we are in a warming trend right now. This is current temperatures across the region, 65 in Norman, 64 in Tulsa. So it's pretty warm. Don't get used to that warm weather, though. We're tracking our next cold front to hit the area, as well as a game day forecast and the possibility for freezing lows ahead. So we'll have all your answers coming up. Back to you guys at the desk. Thanks, Jenna. Still to come, more Oklahomans have fallen victim. Welcome back to OU Nightly, guys. It is a cloudless day here in Norman, and it's pretty warm out, 64 degrees, and we have a blustery southwest wind hitting us 17 miles per hour. So. We do have a wind shift coming up tonight, so our southwest winds will be shifting to a north wind tonight by midnight, reaching us to 41 at midnight. So it'll be kind of chilly tonight because of that north wind bringing in some cooler air with us. Lows tonight across the state will be below normal because of that. 35 is our low here in Norman, 36 in OKC. So we do have another wind shift happening tomorrow after this. So we'll be in the north at 8 a.m. coming from the north. And our winds will be shifting from the south to end our workday. So we'll have those southerly winds heating us up in the afternoon. And we'll be reaching just average across the state here in Oklahoma. 61 as our high tomorrow. 62 in OKC. So we're talking about that cold front coming up. We're going to track that for you guys right now. We have a few dry lines hitting us. And then this cold front coming in. So this is Saturday, late Saturday morning. So this will be hitting us before the game Saturday. And it'll be bringing in some cooler air with it. And then on Sunday, we have a high pressure system situating itself over the area. So we'll be dry here for a bit. How will this cold front affect the game? So it's a late kickoff Saturday, 630. We'll be in the lower 40s for the game. We'll have some cloud cover around and we have a wind coming from the northeast, 10 to 18 miles per hour. So a bit blustery too. So it'll be a chilly one out there definitely because of that cold front. Rounding out your next two days, we have that wind shift tomorrow, and it will be warm, 61 degrees is your high, and tomorrow, cold front, we have a chilly night ahead. We actually have to, Saturday night, we'll be hitting freezing for our low, and then we'll be hitting 26 for our low on Sunday. So it'll be pretty cold this weekend, but we'll be kind of warming up this week, and we do have a rain chance on Wednesday, so that's the day before Thanksgiving, biggest travel day of the year, so let's hope that that's all right for everyone traveling out of Will Rogers or anywhere for Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. Definitely people need to make sure that they are careful.